Hey you guys, it's your girl KJ back with another video. Today I'm going to be doing another product review. So today we're going to do eyelashes. So today we're going to try out some bogus ass dollar store, Chinese store eyelashes with regular glue with and versus these magnetic lashes. So we're going to try out each one and see which one works the best. So let's get it. So, okay. so I'm gonna try out the bogus ones first. So um, I got these eyelashes from uh, uh, AliExpress company that sent them with some some hair that I bought, and I just got the glue from a um, beauty supply store. So, I wonder if I should cut these. I need a mirror. It's a mirror in the magnetic lashes, so I'm gonna just use that. Plain out. So I already have on my makeup. I just don't have any mascara or anything on myself. I haven't put lashes on in a long time, so we're gonna see how good I am at this. I might need to cut these, but we're gonna see. Anything that goes close to my eye makes me tear up. All right, so they're finally on. Well, one is finally on. So this is the bogus dollar store lash. So, and then now we're going to try the magnetic lashes. So it came, so it came like this, like so, and um, this was in there, and this was in there, and I got this from Amazon, and um, it was like 13 or 14 dollars, and the name of it is Reusable Magnetic Eyelash 2020 Upgraded 3D Waterproof Magnetic Eyeliner in Multi-Styles Lashes with Tweezers. No glue needed. Two pairs. Okay. So, yeah, it was like $14. And uh, let me just open it. It's cute. Rose gold. Yes. A mirror. And two pairs of eyelashes. And then you have the Tweezers. Like so. And the magnetic eyeliner. So these are the lashes that it came with. And I'm going to just try to pull it off. Okay, so this thing is magnetic, so like it sticks on. So I just 
wanted to try it on my hand just to see if it was gonna stay on my hand. So I'm gonna just like put a line on my hand. And see if it'll stick. I wonder if you have to like let it dry or something. I need to read directions, I'll never read directions. Warranty card. I'm not sure, but we'll, fi we'll figure it out. Okay, so that's on. So 
So let's try again. And we're gonna use the same lash, honey. Reusable, we're gonna see. Why is it so hard to put these on when not the other ones on? It's supposed to be easier. <laughs> my fault that these look so bad because these bogus ones is looking better okay so the thing with these when you put it when you try to put the lash on it takes some of the eyeliner off so you can't stick it back on you have to just keep putting it on if you mess up and you like take it off you have to keep putting more eyeliner on because it'll stick to the lash Okay, so I cleaned it up a little bit. I think it looks okay, but honestly, like, I think these look way better than this. Um, I probably could have did a better job at applicating it, but um, y'all saw how easy that was for me to put on the bogus ones compared to these ones. Maybe I'm just used to bogus ass eyelashes and regular glue maybe i'm just used to the regular way but um yeah i don't really like these that much i feel like these were harder to put on because it's like the stuff kept coming off i would just say just keep your cheap dollar store eyelashes girl these work why fix it if it ain't broke so um yeah i'm gonna stick with ling ling of lashes let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Do you like the bogus ones or do you like the magnetic ones? So let me know. And like, comment, subscribe.